guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna and today I'm back with another set of beauty reviews. And this time around I'm reviewing two products from the brand Milk and I have two of the items from the Hydro range. So this item is called Grip Set and Refresh Spray. That's what it looks like. And then inside this beautiful box here, I have the Grip Primer, Hydro Grip Primer. So I'll just open it up for you. I keep it in the box just because it sort of protects it and protects this beautiful packaging. I didn't want to stuff it up before the video. Um, so yeah, I kept it in there. So both of these products are meant to be a hydrating kind of product and they're meant to help keep the moisture in the skin whilst giving you that traditional result of what would happen with a primer and also a hydrating spray slash setting spray. So I'm going to start with the primer first, the grip primer here. Now I'm not going to do a demo of this on camera today. I will pump a little bit on the back of my hand because I have tried this already off camera um, for a makeup look and I completely forgot to film it but um, I can definitely show you what it looks like. So this is the texture you're looking at. It's got kind of a gel-like consistency and when you rub it in, it does rub in pretty quick, but it can take a moment to fully sink in. It goes very sticky and tacky and it is a really nice base for makeup. I have actually worn this on its own quite a lot as well. And I find that it, it's really nice at just giving you a really smooth feel to the skin. Um, it just evens out that texture. Um, and just gives you a very smooth feeling on the face, which is actually, it, it is quite nice for just a personal thing, just to have your face feeling very soft. It gives you a little bit of confidence uh, throughout the day, but it does behave really, really well with a variety of foundations. I have tried it with a variety of foundations and you really don't need a lot of product. I've barely, it's barely moved up the little stopper down the bottom, which moves up as you use the product. I've, I've barely used any of it. Um, it's, really really nice and it, a little goes a long way spread it out it will take a moment to sort of get rid of its tackiness but once the tackiness is gone it's ready to go it'll really help give your makeup that more smooth look to it obviously it won't erase all your pores and all the texture but it definitely helped me out quite a lot now in terms of a hydro or hydrating primer i i wouldn't say it was overly hydrating i just found that it was a very nice sort of silicone style primer that it just sort of filled in those pores really nicely. I didn't feel like it added a ton of moisture to my skin. I felt like it just gave that really nice barrier between my skin and my makeup, which is pretty much all you can ask for. But I think if you're looking at this thinking, oh, Hydro it might be good for dry skin, mm, I, I don't know. I would definitely try and test it out first in stores. Uh, before purchasing it if you have dry skin but I think it would be really good for even oily skin just from the way it dried down and just like it, it's pretty much already dry already like there's a little bit of tackiness left but it dries really really nicely and it doesn't let the oil through easily so I suspect if you have oily skin this could be a really great product for you so yeah I highly highly recommend this product I think it did a really great job for me personally and here is the grip set and refresh spray so it's technically not a setting spray it's more of a refreshing spray hydrating spray it does have the sort of oil in water formula so you do need to give it a shake like this and it will sort of disperse the oil in the water now because it does have that extra layer of oil in there it definitely gives you a little bit more of a hydrating feel which is exactly what you would expect from a product like this and I really love using it alone and over makeup I just feel like it gives the skin a really natural glow I wouldn't say it really sets the makeup per se or anything like that it doesn't promise that like I said but it does give just that it just takes away that powderiness and if it's getting a little bit too matte it just sort of brings it back to life your makeup and it just brings it all back together and just gives you that nice cohesive look that you're looking for so yeah I really really like this product these were sort of some of the first products that I've tried from milk I have bought a few other bits and pieces from milk but I haven't formally reviewed them on my channel uh, I regularly use the matcha 
um, toner. I can't, can't remember its exact name, but it's like a stick. It's a solid toner. And I've been really enjoying that. So once I've run out of that, I'll give you a little mini review in my product empties videos. But yeah, I, I'm actually really surprised with milk um, and the way the products are performing. I bought these products from the Selfridges website, just to let you guys know. They are going to bring out a primer base, but for eyelids very soon, it's going to be like a brush on kind of formula. So I am really looking forward to trying that out. Uh, when that does drop, I've been sort of waiting for it to drop on the Selfridges website uh, in the UK so I can order it from there. Uh, but I... Yeah, I think it's available in the US now or it is coming very soon to the US. I can't remember. So, yeah, that's definitely something to look into as well. And I will hopefully be reviewing that very soon for you guys as well. So there we go. Thank you so much for joining me for this little mini review on these two. I hope it was helpful for you in your purchasing decisions. Let me know if you're looking into any other milk products or if you own anything from milk at the moment and what your thoughts are. I'd love to hear it down below in the comments. But until next time, take care and I do hope to see you next time. Bye for now.